Okay guys, welcome back because I can gaming and today we have three, that's right, three solo working glitches for the weekend if you guys want to have some fun, if you want to troll, if you want to make some money or if you want to get a free car, we're going to show you how to do all of it guys. Like always, if you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping in. Don't forget that we're going to give away five million dollars today, back to back, five times. Just subscribe. Leave a comment down below with your GT and what console you're on and we will hook you up. So the first one, guys, I'm going to show you is going to be the Speedo Custom God Mode. So it still works as of today. Uh, timing could be a little tricky sometimes, but it really isn't that bad. I hit it on my first time, uh, first try this time. So if I can hit it, you can definitely hit it. So what happens is your Speedo Custom will stay in God Mode. You can still be shot through the windows. So I suggest doing this in the free aim lobby if you want to troll some people, but you can't die from the oppressors, the Mark IIs, the orbital cannon. Nothing can kill you other than someone shooting you through the window. So if you uh, are a good driver, just back up to people and shoot them that way. They can't shoot through the back windows. So what you're going to do, guys, is you're going to get in your Speedo Custom. You're going to hit right on the D-pad to modify it. And then what you're going to do is you're going to back out. You're going to exit the garage. As soon as you click exit the garage, the screen starts to go black. You start spamming your Xbox or PlayStation button. It should spawn you outside. Just do the spamming until you're outside. And then you're going to pull out your rocket. You're going to turn around. You're going to shoot it. And if it doesn't blow up, then it's in God mode. If it blows up like that, then it's not in God mode. So as you see there, I didn't hit it on my first try. I thought I did, so I do apologize. I'm going to show you that I hit it on my second try, and then you can go on with it. So it's quite simple. I find the only issue with timing is you want to start spamming the Xbox or PlayStation button as soon as the screen starts to fade to black. So you see, get in, hit right on the D-pad to modify, hit B or circle to back out, exit the garage, and then screen goes black. You start spamming that Xbox or PlayStation button, and you don't stop spamming it until you go outside you see here here i am here let's jump out we'll try it one last time if it blows up it is not in god mode if it doesn't blow up it is and survey says boom it is in god mode so now we can go around guys we control the lobby if we want if you don't like this god mode and maybe you want an airplane god mode check out the link top right hand corner that is still working as well guys so now you can go around have some fun with this so here is your number one glitch that is still working for the weekend guys would be the speedo custom god mode let's get into a solo money glitch so here is a good solo money glitch guys you need to have a penthouse or just go to the casino it works either or i like the penthouse because i can load into my bedroom and what i'm going to do guys if you look i have 300 uh, 3.7 million dollars let's see if we can break four million dollars by doing that pretty well next and nothing so what i'm going to do is i'm going to do max bets guys and i'm going to bet against the house obviously that part isn't a glitch that's just normal gambling but i'm going to show you how you can keep your money each and every time so as you see here, I won this one, so I can't show you on this one. We'll continue, and I can guarantee you by the time this video is over, I'll be at $4.3 million. So I won the first one. I'm going to back away from the table. I'm going to go to style. I'm going to go to appearance, and I'm going to change any type of appearance. If you want to change your watch, your earrings, your hat, your shirt, whatever the case may be, in the bottom right-hand corner right quickly, I just seen it that it flashed that it was saving. Now I didn't see it when I was doing the gameplay, so I do apologize, but if you watch it quickly, you will see. So what you want to do is you want to change your appearance so it forces a save. So right now I have $3.8 million, and I started off with $3.7 million. Again, I'm still waiting for the save, and for some reason it wasn't showing up, but it did save. So what's going to happen is once you force your save, you're going to go back to the same table you were just at, you're going to go max bet and you're going to be stupid with your bets. So like I was doubling down on things I wouldn't double down on. I was splitting two tens when you shouldn't split two tens against the ten. I was just being foolish because I know if I lost, I'd still keep my money. So that's what you want to do. Just be foolish. Have some fun with it. I'm going to double down on this against the ten. Boom, there's 20. I lucked out there. He has 18. So there's some more money. I just won 200K. So now I'm at $3.9 million. So I'm going to back away from the table, do the same thing. Go style, go to accessories, and just change any little accessory so it forces a save. I'm going to go back to the table. So this stuff isn't really a glitch yet because all I'm doing is winning and forcing a save. Yeah, but what happens if you lose? I'm going to show you that, guys. That way, if you lose, you can still continue to keep your money. And then that way, you can continue to bank your money. And like I said, by the end of this video... I will have $4.3 million. So I made like a half a million dollars in like five minutes, not even guys. So 
As you see here, back here, max bet again, and away we go. And again, I just want to bet the most stupidest bets, double down on the most stupidest stuff, just so I can make the cash. So you see here, I have a good hand. What I'm going to do is I'm probably going to split them. That way I can try for even more money, because that's how you're going to make the most money as possible, and hope for two tens. Now, I didn't get two tens, as you see, and the dealer is going to beat me. Well, you see, I had $3.9 million. Let's see here. All you're going to do is once you see that you lose, you're going to dashboard and close the application and then reload back into the game. That's all you need to do. Now, I was in a lobby with a friend, so I'm just going to rejoin him, guys. And when we get back in, we'll have the same amount of cash that we started off with. And then we're going to continue on our road to $4.3 million. So once you guys load back in, you'll see here I still have my $3.9 million. And I'm just going to run back over to the casino table that I have up in my penthouse. Like I said, it just you spawn in your penthouse. It makes life so much easier, guys. You don't got to run through the casino where it's slow and you can't really run and you got to go around people. So I find the penthouse works. If you don't own a penthouse, then just do the same thing in the casino, guys. You'll still make your money. So you see, I started off with $3.9 million this time. Let's see if we can hit $400. $4.3 million is what I want to see. So again, I just bet on the most stupidest stuff. If I have to double down, if I have a chance to double down, guys, I always double down. I will take it so I can win. So here we go. I'm at $3.9 million still, and I'm just going to just won that hand. So I'm going to keep going, and as you see, this is a super easy glitch, and the only thing you need to have is a penthouse. If you don't have a penthouse, just use the casino itself, and you pretty well need nothing other than knowing how to dashboard. So... When this is going, and I'm showing you guys that I'm going to make $4.3 million off of this, make sure you remember that there's other glitches that work just like this. So we do have the orbital cannon glitch. So it's a free orbital cannon with no cooldown. It's the same concept. I'll link it up in the corner, guys, if you want to check that out. So that's four working glitches if that's the case we're going. Five if you're going to include the uh, airplane god mode glitch and six if you're going to include selling your elegy for free or selling a free elegy for nine hundred thousand dollars which is up on the screen as well make sure you check that out so as you see here i just split two tens just for the sake of doing it and i'm going to double down on both just because i want to make this video go quick and i want to earn some mad cash and as you've seen i split a winning hand doubled down on both and i think it's going to pay it oh my god it paid out for me so there you guys go, 400K, I'm at 4.1 million dollars. I'm just gonna back away from the table, that was a really good hand, and what I'm gonna do is force another save. Once you force that save, guys, it's the same thing. Go back to the table, keep doing that same thing over and over again, and you're gonna get yourself a million dollars in a hurry. That's actually probably quicker than it takes me to do uh, Act 2. If you're unfamiliar with Act 2, well, make sure you Google it, because you can get... Uh, a million dollars every 12 minutes so that's a pretty good glitch too so as you see here guys i jump back on the table i'm going to do it one more time i'm going to go in if i can double down i'm going to double down just to see if i can get the most money as possible and then we are going to win this so i have two aces which is a good hand for doubling down let's take one card each and see what we get so here we go so there's a blackjack, which is even better. The next one I'm going to double down on just because it will let me and it's a free card and hopefully i have enough that i win it all and as you see here, there is 8, there is 11, 16, and 1, 17. Oh, there we go. I won both of them, so I have $4.3 million. Let's get on with the third and final glitch. So here you guys go. This one is going to be the free podium car. So I don't want the podium car. I already own the bike, but I'm going to show you guys how to do it. You're going to spin the wheel, and if you don't like what you get, you're going to do the same thing that you've seen on the last one. You're just going to open up your Xbox or PlayStation menu, and you're going to close the application. So as you see here, I'm spinning, I'm spinning. What I'm going to get, I'm going to get some RP. I don't want the RP, so I'm going to open it up, close the application, and I'm going to reload back in. Now, I'm not going to make you guys watch the loading time, so let's see what else the next spin will give us. So here we are. I load it back in, guys. I'm going to try this again. Again, I don't want the bike, but I just want to see and show you guys that you can get it. So this is my second turn for today. I still have the $4.2 million I made in, earlier in the video. And right here, I won the bike. But I don't want the bike. I already own it. I'm just going to dashboard it. I'm going to come back in. I'm going to spin it one last time just to see what I can get. Maybe I can get some new clothing, get something that I don't already have. Since I have the bike, I don't want it a second time because they won't sell for nothing. Don't forget, guys, if this worked for you, leave a comment down below saying it worked as of today's date. 
And just with that little comment, if you put your GT and what console you play in, you're entered into the $5 million giveaway. So once we load back in, guys, I'm going to do one more quick spin, and that's going to be it. And again, you can spin this as many times as you want, as long as you quit and dashboard. And this time, I'm just going to settle whatever I get, as long as it's not a car, and I won some cash. Thanks for checking me out, guys. I really do appreciate it, and we'll definitely catch you on the next one.